What's happening, fellas? Feast your eyes on this absolutely stunning Suzuki RV125. Very rare to find them in this kind of condition with a brand new engine in them, but I'll go over the details of that in a minute. But starting with the, the, the base core bike itself, only has 2,571 miles on it. It's original right down to the tires, the paint, the bars, the grips, the tacks, everything's a real low mileage survivor that the engine was just removed from the frame and completely rebuilt from the crank up. I'll get into that in a second, but it's been, uh, Jimmy Lauren and I just went through the whole engine. We've got a, a pretty lengthy work order here, but uh, starting with the base bike, the original paint, the original tires, the original rims, the forks, everything's intact and correct on this, which is pretty remarkable for a almost 50 year old classic on an off-road bike. Now this bike was built by Suzuki uh, to kind of start a, a new, a new style of bike a new trend it was a four seasons bike where you could ride it in the snow with the big not big giant flotation tires you could ride it in the sand you could ride it in the mud you could ride it on road and you could ride it off road it was actually street legal it came out with the tail light and the headlight a tachometer and a speedometer uh everything you need to 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 to, to ride it on the street um the uh original paint is in good condition got a little bit of patina on it but it's original uh, the original tail lights intact, the exhaust system's like new. Uh, I guess I want to get into the engine next and I'll grab the work order so I don't miss anything. But uh, Jimmy took the engine right out of the frame and completely dismantled it and completely rebuilt it from the crankshaft up. I'll go over his notes here in a second. So he uh, removed the engine, dismantled it, replaced the crankshaft connecting rod, replaced the main bearings and the seals, did a complete gasket kit on it, which is a head gasket, base gasket. Uh, while he had it apart, he spec the cylinder in the piston was perfectly in spec so he just honed the cylinder cleaned the carbon off the top of the piston and polished the cylinder head um it's got new new um uh, complete new gasket kit the carb was rebuilt cleaned serviced and the jetting was dialed in he put a new air filter in it uh cleaned the air box new spark plug clean and adjust ignition points set the timing bled the oil injection pump and installed this brand new uasa battery you see here Adjusted the brakes front and rear, adjusted the chain, set the tire pressure, test rode it. He had a big smile on his face when he came back. Thing runs like brand new, as, as I concur. Um, while he had it apart, the paint was stripped on the engine. The engine was completely repainted. You can see the cylinder and the head and the engine cases have all been refinished in the original factory, factory black. It looks a little crisp and brand new. It's new on the inside. It's new on the outside. It's ready, ready for another 50 years. Um, we have BP non-ethanol fuel in there. The gas tank was rinsed out and flushed of the, of the old gas and it has brand new, uh, well, of course it's brand new, BP ethanol free fuel. That's an important part because the pump fuel is what causes problems in the classic bikes with the ethanol and everything. So um, you can run pump gas, but you gotta put stabilizer in it and it can gum up the carbs and stuff like that. So uh, topped off the oil injection tank and uh, gave it a clean bill of health. Then I went down to the detail shop where it was steam cleaned, hot water pressure washed, hand washed, degreased, uh, touched up the frame. The wheels look to be like in brand new condition as you can see. The exhaust was stripped of the paint and repainted as was the engine. Uh, polished all the chrome, the bars, the forks, the hardware, the controls, etc. Uh, cleaned the tires, the seat and grips, all the rubber on it. And she's absolutely beautiful. Uh, the total between the detail and the service department was 12 hours labor plus parts. The invoice came out to $1,807 to completely rebuild the engine. All gaskets and seals, connecting rod, um, main bearings uh everything's done on it and then it was completely restored cosmetically uh, just a beautiful piece in its original factory uh condition with a with a beautiful original factory paint job even the chrome on the exhaust uh, shield is still in good condition just a just a, a cool classic highly collectible suzuki rv 125 they made a, a reproduction, a new model, as they call it, the Van Van, that looks like this because people were asking for it back. But to find a mint original is just unheard of. Beach yeah. Cruiser. Yeah, Beach Cruiser for sure. If you have any questions about it, give us a call, 860-454-7024. Message your zip code for a shipping quote and call in. We do financing through Freedom Road on Classics, 860-454-7024. Get you pre-approved, get it out the door, ship it to your door. Yeah, we can ship it, we can finance it, uh, whatever you need. It's going into the museum on display in the Jap Japanese finished trail bike section. If you want to come take a look at it, it's on display here. It's a beautiful piece. Study the pictures. If you have any questions, call us. Thanks for watching. God bless America. Guys, no video would be complete without a quick drive-by on the street because this thing is street legal. Send it.
you want to turn heads in the city, I can't think of a better way than to do it on a 50-year-old classic like this. You'll be the only one in the city with one. It's a rare piece. It's a hell of a lot of fun to ride. really low, you can climb the side of a mountain with this and it will roar, it'll roar, rip your house off the mountain. Alright guys, always remember to like, share, and subscribe to Capital America on YouTube, Capital America on Instagram, also Captain Cycles on uh, YouTube. Like, share, and subscribe, hit that bell button, let us know that you guys will get full notifications on when new videos are uploaded. Also, Captain Cycles is a one-stop shop for all 2023 gas gas models, ranging from the MC65s all the way to the 450F Troy Lee Designs, the Bam Bam. Uh, edition. So God bless America. Y'all know the deal.